Patrick Bouich from Eureka. I'm going to show you how to create and submit your project application on our network projects and Global Stars platform. So let's start with the first step, which is creating an account in the platform. From our website, you can reach the login page by either clicking on open calls or access my product space. If you are a new user, click on register here and complete the registration form. Please note that if you are based in Europe, your organization's unique identification number is the same as your VAT number. But if you are based outside of Europe, this may have a different title like business identification number. Once you submit the registration form, you will receive an email confirming your username and password. Make sure to check your spam folder. Now you can log in into the platform. The first thing you will see is your dashboard, which is divided into four sections. Below each section header, there is a short description of what they include. The tabs at the top of the dashboard allow you to manage your personal and organization profiles, change your passwords and log out. You will also find a link to access guidelines and a home button you can use whenever you want to reach the dashboard. You can follow up on the progress of your application and task using the shortcuts on the dashboard. Before we look at creating an application, you need to define whether you are the main partner or a partner organization in your consortium. Each project consortium must nominate a main partner organization and have at least one other partner organization. Establishing whether you are the main partner or a partner organization in your consortium will be important for understanding which parts of the application you need to complete. We will now go through all the main partner tasks. After registering and becoming familiar with your dashboard, you need to select a call for projects. Click on Open Calls on your dashboard. This will display our open network projects and Global Stars funding opportunities. We have one call for projects that is always open. You can apply to this at any time. Let's take the Singapore Turkey call as an example. You can read the information about the call for projects in the downloadable PDF. These will include eligibility criteria and additional information requested by your national funding body. Select the call for projects you want to apply to and click on apply now. You will be giving an empty application form. Please read important information here. You can minimize or pop out this window at any time. The first thing you need to do is click on Save Draft. Your application will receive an identification code, which includes your unique project number, an acronym of the program you are applying to, and the call for projects code. Your screen shows two sections, your partner form and the project application form. We will explain how to complete the partner form later because it is relevant for all partners. The application form has four sections, overview, impact, excellence, and quality and efficiency of the implementation. As you are filling in your application form, more instructions on how to best answer the questions can be found next to or below each question. All fields in the application form are mandatory and some have a world limit. We recommend that you fill in as much information in your application form as you can before inviting your other consortium partners. This way, they can view the latest version of the application form 
and see information they need to complete their partner form. For example, the work packages. You can complete your project work packages list at the end of the overview section above the pitch. Click on open work packages and add as many rows as you need by pressing the plus button. Fill out all fields and click save. This table will be visible in all partner forms for your partners to use as a reference to list their tasks in the project. Some information in the application form like the consortium overview table or the number of person months is filled in automatically when the partner forms are complete. Almost everything we need to know is stated in your application form. So the only document we need you to attach at an annex is a Gantt diagram. The main partner uploads this in the quality and efficiency of the implementation section. However, national funding bodies may have specific requirements for organization based in their country. So please read all the information about the call for projects you are applying to and upload relevant annexes at the bottom of the overview section. The main partner must upload these annexes on behalf of all the partners. As the main partner, you need to invite other partners to your project application. Click on Invitations in the left-hand side menu. Then click on the plus icon to add all your consortium partner organization. Fill in your project partner's details and assign them the role of partner. Then click on Invite and your partners will receive an email invitation that will let them view the application form and complete their own partner form. If your partner hasn't accepted your invitation yet, you can resend it or retract it. However, if you want to remove a partner who has already accepted your invitation, you need to contact us at projects at eurekanetwork.org. The next part of your project application that you need to complete is the partner form, which all project partner organization, including the main partner, must fill in individually. You can find the partner form from your dashboard listed as a pending task. Each partner form has two sections, the partner form and a co-signature form. Begin by opening the partner form and click Save Draft. Then, complete the form and the work packages table by adding budget details. Please do refer to the work package list completed by the main partner in your project. To add more work packages, click on the plus icon. When you save your budget information, it is added to the budget details table automatically. Next, open the co-signature form. Here, you must fill in the name, title and position of someone legally authorized to represent your organization. Click Save Draft and this information is added to the co-signature form. Now download the document as a PDF file, sign it manually or electronically. Upload your document in PDF and if you are a partner in the project, click on Send to Main. When you send it to the main partner to be reviewed, your partner form task on your dashboard will be listed as in progress. The main partner has some more work to do. When a project partner submits their partner form, you, the main partner, will see a new pending item on your dashboard under my activities. You need to open and review the submitted partner and co-signature forms. If you think parts of the form are unclear, visit the revisions tab, specify what your project partner needs to change and click on send for clarifications. 
If the form is correct, click on Approve. When all partners have submitted their partner forms, this will be listed in the Overview of the Consortium section of your application form. You can also use the notes section of our platform to communicate with your project partners, your contact in your national funding body, and our help desk. To send a note, click on the plus icon, select the recipient of your notes from the drop down menu titled Note Types, write your note, and click on Save to send your note. The recipient will receive an email notification. All partners can view the application in PDF format at any time. It updates automatically whenever you save. The last step is submitting your application. But if ever you want to delete your application before the call deadline, click on Remove and it will disappear from your dashboard. Make sure all partner forms, including your own and your application form, are complete and that you have double checked everything against the call for project instructions. Click on Save and Validate to check whether you're missing any mandatory information before you submit. You will receive an email confirming that you have successfully submitted your project application. Please note that after you have submitted your application, you cannot make changes to it. However, you can request to reopen your application by emailing us at projects at eurekanetwork.org before the call for projects deadline. Once you submit your application, we will review it to ensure it is complete and that your project is eligible. If successful, your project will be evaluated. You can track the status of your application on your dashboard. In addition, you will receive email notifications. We are looking forward to receiving your network projects and Global Stars application. Thank you for watching and good luck. Mm -hmm.